Hello everyone and welcome back to Sliverstar Arcade. Last time on Oceanhorn, Monster of Uncharted Seas, we got the bow. And in this episode, we are going to use it to uh, finally solve these puzzles and reach into the dungeon. Wait a minute, I want... Oh, that's nice. It locks you in place when you're holding it so you can aim and by hitting any other button you can cancel out of it so you don't have to shoot the arrow that is nice that is nice game design right there oh what I still got hit that's some bull okay Alright, so basic arrow trap. Oh yeah, we also got um, another heart container. So we now have five maximum hearts. Ah, uh, there we go. Covered by the bush. Has there ever been a Zelda puzzle where it's like something was covered by bush and you had to cut it down? Like I know there was like uh, uh, don't fall down. Okay. This is going to collapse. Soul above, Nito below, emblem of earth in the center hall. Really? All the way up here, just tell me to go back to the center hall. Give me those three arrows. You know what? No, we're gonna. I want to try something. <gasps> no. 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 Right. There we go. Have feeling. Central Hall. Ah, so I'm pretty sure this is what I saw in the trailer. Evil Overgrowth Termos. Alright, so it seems like we have to start by taking out the tentacles. Alright, disappear. Come here. Oh god, the onions. No, come here. Okay, what, did I have the right idea? Like, am I supposed to use a bow and arrow? Because the bombs seem to have been pretty effective. Alright. Here, we'll, we'll switch to the bow and arrow. Just to see what it does. doesn't seem to do as much so I guess bombs are the way to go uh, I might actually die in this fight back back Okay, so I think that's what you're supposed to do. You're supposed to outrun him. Yep, 
Yeah, see, it's giving me... I think it's just random drops at this point. Like, it's not like, oh, they're giving me more arrows or bombs because that's what I'm supposed to use. I think it's just random. Yeah, you're definitely supposed to be using bombs because they get sucked in. Alright, well, this is a pretty cool first, like, major boss. Come on, drop a heart. There we go. Stop running away. Oh, wait, was that it? And we just walk away. Trick to me into these jerk shackles. But now I'm free to start the reconstruction of the world wherever I go, I'll travel. I can't tell if that thing's speaking English or not. The great forest shrine. I can finally return here to sing a long song to my ancestors. The least I can do as last of my kind is to show respect to my roots. Maybe you would allow us to join you. Yeah, so they just appeared out of nowhere. We will settle here and start a new page of history of Oru's here. Take this. This is, the acorn. this is an acorn of the last tree in withered lands. Plant it in the place that is close to your heart. Cool. Can I, can I get by you? I kind of want to talk to these people. You are a talented swordsman. It is good to have you on our side. So, so I was right. Who is this guy? Never seen him before. Oru. There's still hope for us. Oru. Oh, he's just named Oru. Wait, wait, no, get that. Have you heard the legendary weapon, the crow suit? I heard it washed ashore a riptide reef along Sea Lork's body. Okay. Hey, it's me, Hermit. You really found the emblem of Earth. Come see me when you have time. I need you to pick up something for me. Riptide Reef. I'd say we got time. Let's go do that now. Still don't know what that new sword skill thing was. Oh, well, there's my favorite boat again. You earned a new adventurer level. I'm going to have a good time into Carl. I think you're going the wrong way then. I think you're going the wrong way, buddy. Pretty sure to Carl's the other way. Um, but yeah, so apparently shooting boxes also gets you crystals. So once I get off this, once I get off here, I can level up. Hey, the barrel I threw here is still here. You are an adventurer. You can now carry up to 15 arrows at a time. Wait, could I only carry 10 before? Well, that's stupid. 
jellies and scuttlebugs. Man, I don't think we've been here since we started the game. Come to meet me at the well near your tent. Yeah, I think I'd rather go in here. Break all your stuff. Um. Yep, bombs. Man, old man was holding out on me. No, I don't want to go back in. Why are doors always our enemies? Hey, hermit. I need you to jump down to, down to this well. Inside, you will find horrors that sometimes keep me up at night, but it'll be worth it. Bring me a package that belonged to my friend, Teppo the archaeologist. Inside that package, there's something that can help us. The well is too high for you to just climb in there. The well is too high for you to just climb there. What? So am I supposed to blow it up? Okay, well then, how, I, how do I do it then? Ah, uh, back to our first ever glitch. Phasing through rocks and such. Well, huh. Maybe we gotta go around. Maybe that's it. So we can go down here into the caves. Where will that bring us, though? Up here, so then we can just... There we go! Could we have done this earlier? I don't know. I was correct. The great chronicler was buried on this deserted island. I came here together with my friend. We built a base of operation out here on a rock. He will keep track of the progress. I will start studying this grave. I guess we technically... The great chronicler, scholar of the past and the future, rests here. This grave is blessed by the almighty Gaia and Kronos. Begin in the end, the room of answers gives you the knowledge that you need. So could we have come here at any time? A noise kept me up for the night. I'm a little nervous, but knowing the kinds of clues to Arcadia's history that may be found inside, I have to face my fears and enter. All right, well, it looks like the start of a brand new dungeon. Secret sword, how did I do that? Oh. I get it. It's the spin attack. Alright, well, with that, uh, we're going to leave this off here. In the next episode, uh, we will continue this dungeon. As always. Oh, God, look at that bug over there. Uh, be safe, have fun, and have a great day.